Hey guys, today we're going to be checking out Remember the Titans from 2000. Let's get to it. Okay, we got a football movie here, winner of my football movies poll, American football, not to be confused with football in the rest of the world, which we call soccer. And I'm really happy to see another Denzel Washington movie. If you missed Crimson Tide, make sure you check it out. It's a sports movie. Have I even done any sports movies based on a true story? Cool, 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 cool. Okay, yay. I like based on a true story. Virginia, 1981. In Virginia, high school football is a way of life. My daddy coached in Alexandria up until 1971 in Alexandria, there was no race mixing. In 1971? Man, that seems late. July 1971. That summer, a black teenager was killed by a white store owner, and the city was on the verge of exploding. You caused enough damage. This is my store. Jeez. Oh, come on, Kurt. Don't we break that you down like that? You're twice the size. People play like that and lose every game. I didn't think that was so bad. She should be the coach. <laughs> Coming down <gasps> the door. It's Ryan Gosling. They want to burn the place up because that color kid got shot. Hey. Oh, hey. Get in the truck. Gary, Alan, Ray. Yeah, cool off, boys. Hell, why don't you just kick them all off the team? I don't want to play with any of those black animals. Who are you? I'm Herman Boone. I'm the new assistant coach. Oh, good luck. This was the time that was arranged for me to meet with Coach Yost. He's going to have a rough time, I think. I come to win. Well, I won a couple of titles down in North Carolina. That's double-A ball. This here's Virginia. We play AAA. Well, what an opportunity for me, then. Yeah, he's gonna have to prove himself. School board has decided that Herman Boone is gonna be the head coach at TC. It's not fair. My daddy's head coach. They're firing the head coach? You can't just walk in here and take my daddy's job away. She's a firecracker. <laughs> I left North Carolina because I was passed over for a job. Gave it to a white coach down. Now you are asking me to do the same thing to this man? Doesn't want it. Coach Boone, black folks have never had anything in this city to call their own except humiliation and Spare. Herman, I think that you, you better look outside. Oh no. Is it dangerous for them? Uh, okay, that's nice. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be troublemakers. All right, good. Wait a minute now. I'm not answering your prayers. I'm not a savior or a Jesus Christ, Martin Luther King or the Easter Bunny. I'm a football mm. coach, that's all. He's humble. <laughs> and he will lead them to victory on the football field. Coach Yost here. We're busy interviewing for head coaching jobs. Got 11 offers and certainly no time for you. Wow. Hates him. Well, come on in. I've got an office out back. Can they make the peace? I'm worried about my boys. The best player will play. That's fair, right? I think that it would go a long way to smooth things over if you would stay. Work under you. Oh, well, he's not going to do that. Good night, coach. I mean, putting the race stuff aside, that is kind of insulting. He didn't mean it in an insulting way, but I could see how he would see it that way. I'll be taking the year off. I say boycott TC Wizards. Get him, Fred. He stole your job. I'm not playing for him. I started a petition and I'm sitting this season out. Oh, it's just going to punish yourself, kid. Only play for you, Coach Young. Don't go, Coach. Can't leave it. Play some ball, y'all. Black inside. Black inside. Oh, I know this guy from Clueless. Can I tell you all them white boys won't play for no brother? Well, who needs them, baby? From now on, the Titans is going to be powered by soul power, bro. I wonder if any of the old team's going to show up. Put your hand down. Why are you smiling? Because I love football. Football's fun. Fun, sir. Fun, sir. Does he run a tight ship? We leave for camp August 15th. 7.29 a.m. If you report at 7.30, you will not be playing football this season. Runs a tight ship. It is a dictatorship. Wow. I am the law. If you survive camp, you will be on the team. This is going to be uh, an intense camp. Uh-oh, okay, yeah. What's going to happen here? Oh, man. Are they just going to make two teams, maybe? With him calling the shots, ain't none of us going to see nothing but the bench this year. He ain't calling the shots, you'll play. He's going to pick whoever is best for the position. I think he cares about winning. I think he cares about football. I want a job for Coach Tyrell. He's been with me for 10 years. You're overcooking my grits, Coach. <laughs> All right. I will allow Coach Tyrell, but I will have my eye on him. And you. Wow, he runs a tight ship even with the other coaches. Okay. Forever? Go. Here we go. All right, we're going to football camp. You want any of us to play for you? You reserve half the open positions for Hammond players. Parents, out of here. Very nice, I want. 
take a good look at him. He's not afraid. Because once you get on that bus, you ain't got no mama no more. You got your brothers on the team. You got your daddy. Now, you know who your daddy is, don't you? Is it him? <laughs> Who's your daddy, Gary? You, sir. You. He commands respect in such a hostile environment. Wow. Uh, Dean, fix that tie, son. Oh, they're going to listen. Because in the end, they all want to win at football, I am sure. So they're going to have to choose what's more important to them. All right. Everybody, go off the bus. Listen up. I don't care if you're black, green, blue, white, or orange. You and you. Offensive bus, sit together. Forcing it to happen. Well, deal with it, buddies. Ain't no valley blow. Blue. Shut up. Got that right. You can shut up too. But are they gonna be able to play as a team? They have to be brothers, right? Like teammates. They have to get along. I ain't looking at that for two weeks, man. Take it down. You close your eyes for two weeks, all I care. Oh, this is gonna be rough. This is not gonna be easy for them to get along. Bye. Bye. Boys. You got anger. That's good. You're gonna need it, son. Football is about controlling that anger. We will be perfect in every aspect of the game. You drop a pass, you run a mile. A mile. <laughs> Get up, boy! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! I mean, they have to respect him, right? Hands up! Hands up! I am very happy to see the other coach here with him. Defense! His desire! Fire! The heck, kid is. She's something. Don't be careful! Football's just like an American thing too. Like I know we have Canadian Football League, but it's not a big deal here, I don't think. What you doing, man? Eat lunch. Why are you eating over here? Oh come on. Don't you go on over there eat with your people. I'm with everybody, Julius. I like this guy. Look at that traitor. Rev. You better be praying I'll block for his black behind. I'll just buy my time. Until what? I hope there's no violence in this, like feel like there has to be. Each one of you will spend time every day with a teammate of a different race. You will learn about him and his family. Until that time, we go to three-a-day practice. Wow. These guys, I don't know. They're gonna put me in the movies. What do you think of this one? Does the term cruel and unusual punishment mean anything to you? <laughs> Nobody from my family ever went to no college. I'll tutor you, Louie. I'm white you. trash. Aw, I hope you can make it to college. What are y'all doing? 44 stack. You're supposed to know your job. Don't you think I'm stupid or something? I'm the team captain, and I don't need you up on my face. All the team. They're going to have to get along. There's no way they can win. Oh, we need a water break. We've been out here all day. Break. You need a water break. Water is for cowards. <laughs> water makes you weak. No water ever. Here's a question that's gonna make everyone upset. Who's in better shape, football players or soccer players? All right, get some water. Hey, wait your turn, boy. You call me what? Oh man. Come on, you're my bunch of sissy. They're all being jerks. Yeah, they just can't even be next to each other. Oh gosh. How is he gonna get them to bond? Wake up, gentlemen. It's late. It's 3 a.m. in the morning. Just we're gonna take a little run through the wood. Coach. It's a high school football team. We're not the Marines here. Let's go. I was kind of thinking the same thing. I'm like, this is very intense. Is this what normal high school football is like in America? That's what might make them champions. Anybody know what this place is? Graveyard. This is Gettysburg. Oh. 50,000 men died right here on this field. Fighting the same fight. Giving them some perspective. If we don't come together, we too will be destroyed. I don't care if you like each other or not, but you will respect each other. And maybe learn to play this game like men. Turning boys into men. All right, we'll be out here all night till we get this thing right. Let's go. Whoa! Come, on, come on, boys, work together. Let's see. Let's see some hustle. That Ray, whatever it is, it ain't blocking once, just one time. I swear to God, I'm gonna hit you so hard by the time you come to. Come on. Run the ball, let's come run on. it again. Let's go. What's he doing with those, with those eyes? That this is what he wants? He wants the captain to the captain? You really stuck him, Campbell! Yeah, I love me a little contact, Petey! This is left side! Wrong side! side. Wait, is this good? <laughs> football! Alright, this is a football thing. Got it. Okay. <laughs> Bruce Boone, I'm Colonel Bass. This is my son, Ronnie, and he's quarterback. How you doing, Ronnie? It's Coach Yost. Big lad. Well, I, uh, I met Coach Tabor. He won't let Blacks play on his team. Oh, I bet he's good. Huck that ball. They can play football. They're a good runner. <laughs> I think we can find a place for you, boy. Nice arm. What a haircut. Jeez. Hey. Sunshine. Sunshine. That's cool. I can dig it. <laughs> hey, you got a little soul power. Okay. 
like them better with the long hair, bruh. Remind me of Bertie's mama. Oh. oh, we got yo mama jokes in the mix now. <laughs> Little elastic, man. What, what worry about this guy? I just gave your mama a piggyback ride and she weighs twice oh. as much. <laughs> he got me. <laughs> All right. What do you want, man? You know what I want? He's not gonna like that. What is going on here? He kissed me, man. <laughs> Ain't no I love Ryan Gosling so much. He used to be on a Canadian show called Breaker High. It's been, he did a good job up here. Oh. He ran a tough camp from what I can see. Approved. Well, I'm very happy to have the approval of a five-year-old. I'm not in the half, thank you very much. She runs a tight ship, too. What is pain? French bread! French bread? Will you ever quit? No! no! We want some hope! They're becoming a team, I feel it. La, 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 la. He's singing! Hey, hey. The grumpy dude! They're buddies now! Welcome home! I mean, was a weekend enough to do it? Home of the Titans. First day of school. Man, this stuff is messed up. Yeah, yeah anything serious happened, they shut the school down and our season go down to drink. Yeah, they gotta keep the peace. Look at them, Gary. They hate us. Nah. Just a bad day. Things have cooled down. I hope so. We don't need you here either, Pippi boy. You hear what he said? Jeez, why can't people just get along, man? Holy. Everyone would be so much happier. Sorry. Julius, this is Emma. You better shake it. Well, that was rude. Back to the real world, Bertia. Been better off staying where we were. Coach, I'm, I'm afraid I put you into a no-win situation. I just found out the board didn't even think you'd make it out of camp. I've learned that at the first sign of trouble. Trouble? What kind of trouble? Lose a game. What, they're gonna kick him out? They'll fire you. What? One game, just like that. What about my family? They don't care. Well, that sucks. Oh, he's getting sick? What, is he nervous? Or is he sick sick? I'm not gonna talk to you tonight about winning and losing. You're already winners because you didn't kill each other up at camp. <laughs> Agreed. We got Hayfield. They don't have to worry about race. We do. But we're better for it, man. Yeah. Greek mythology, the Titans were greater even than the gods. They ruled their universe. Let's rule it like Titans. Woo! Good speech. On the hot 32 yard line. <laughs> She's so cute. All right, let's see a good play here, fellas. You all right? That was a two-year start at GW. I can't play for this, man. You come play linebacker for me. 23 is killing us. I want you to get out there. I want you to cover him for me. But is the coach going to like that? What is Petey doing in there? Come on, let's see. Let's see, let's see. Maybe it'll be awesome. Woo! Okay. There we go. Now we start to win. <laughs> this all looks very good. Everyone's catching and throwing. <laughs> they did it. Even I know that's a touchdown. Oops. Yeah. Hey, Gary. Hop in, bud. We're Hop heading in. over to the hill, Gary. Everyone's gonna be there. Why don't you hang out down here with us? Come with us. Are you coming or not, man? Don't go, Gary. Stay with your team. But I don't know. Maybe he loves her. I, I don't know. All right, listen. About Petey. No thanks required, coach. I don't think he was gonna thank him. You challenged my authority in front of the entire football team, coach. Mm -hmm. Protecting him from Big Bad Boom. You cut my legs from under me. Yeah, that's true. You ain't doing these kids a favor by patronizing. You're crippling them for life. Gotta teach them to be men. Going down to the bird. I'm gonna play basketball with Julius. And we're gonna come back here for dinner. I don't want to get to know him. You are coming to church with your mother. Even these kids know better than their parents. Jeez. Yeah, I'm covered for you. Go Game get my two. Face. Oh, cool out. How many games are there? How's it going, y'all? Man, I didn't sign up to play like this. These guys we're playing got no heart. So dirty. What's he doing, like Tai Chi? The girls love it. Oh, he's so cute. He is very cute. What y'all staying at Old Sunshine for? I'm the one dominating on the field. He ain't played a minute all year. Talking to my girl. Oh, oh boy. More fighting. Hey, 
Looks like you went to the zoo and made some new friends, Bertier. Come on, fellas. That beer's getting better. I'll admit that. But you're still weak on the left side. She's smart. Cheryl, don't you want to play with Nikki? I hate playing with dolls. Don't you want to go accessorize with me? She wants to watch football tapes. Hey, Coach Coon! <gasps> Jeez. That's the thing, like, is it just kids messing around or, like, is there about to be, like, some major violence? You just wouldn't know. First cuffs, man. Coaches ain't called us a meeting tonight. What? We did. Yeah, we came together in camp. Cool. But then we're right back here and the world tells us that they don't want us to be together. Even you grow tired and weary. What <laughs> about Amen. Amen, right? That's right, right? They will walk in that growth. He's cute. You ain't got no heart. No. I want a victory. Yeah. These guys are coming together. I want a victory. Yeah. Party. Okay, boys, let's do it. This is the first true test of the hey, season for the undefeated T.C. Williams Titans. Because tonight they're going up against the undefeated Grove and Lions. Ooh, the undefeateds versus the undefeateds. <laughs> Julius Campbell's playing strong side line with Cheryl. He's so good, he's got all the Not even listening. I do not care. <laughs> Everywhere we go, people want to know. <laughs> I like it. Who do they think they are? The Beatles? Dial, cut them up. It's hard. Go, Titans! Come on! Dance your way to a victory! Hey. Oof. Song's over, Sambo! Hey. Oh, boy. Mm. What happened, Plastic? I, I don't bother. Well, he broke a bone in the wrist. He won't be thrown any more this season. Oh, no! Coach, you guys going back in, man. Not a quarterback, son. I can't make that pitch, coach. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Your team needs you tonight. You're the colonel. You're going to command your troops tonight. Let's go. Come on. You can do it. Louis, let him through, all right? What? Just let him through. Trust me. Ooh, trust me. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, bro. And the quarterback, you kidding me, coach? Are you not allowed to do that in football? I don't. Look fair to me. That's a bad white woman. Now they like him. Hi-oh. Let's go. They won, I assume. All right, listen up, listen up, listen up. Game ball, Ronnie Bass. Hi-oh. So cute. Can I speak with you in private? I want Ray off the team, coach. I know that Ray missed that block on purpose. Did he? He missed it on purpose? Well, you're the captain. Ray, you're out. What? I'm not going to let you play for this team anymore. You willing to just throw away our friendship for them? You can keep on. He's the one that threw the play, right? Officer. He's literally just standing there. Best defense I've seen in 20 years. Tell that coach yours keep up the good work. All right, yay! I thought he was going to give him trouble. Superman! Hey, man, what's going on? Come on, they're chilling. These guys are buddies. Oh, five and zero. Oh. Okay, they're they're winning all over. All right, all right. Oh, nine wins. We are here tonight to honor men that are teaching our young people. Let me introduce to you the 1971 Hall of Fame nominee. Come on, Dave. <laughs> that girl is too cute. You just leave this to us, Bill. Moon's out. No. And you're head coach again. And all roads lead to the Hall of Fame. So now he knows what's up, too. Mr. Fisher, can I talk to you for a second? Back off, coach, if you want to stay in this game. I think the assistant coach is starting to see what's really going on here. I know all about it, Titus. What are you talking about, Bill? You call this game fair, or I'll go to the papers. You dig your own grave. Ethan! He's got a plan. I don't want them to gain another yard. You blitz all night! They remember forever the night they played the Titans. Remember the Titans. <laughs> Come on, boys. Jeez, this is a rough sport. 
Are they winning? Is this good? Ready up, Herman! Leave no doubt! Let's do it! I think he digs his defensive plays. That means touchdown, right? Coach, now that took a straw poll, you just lost yourself the Hall of Fame. I don't think he cares. I think he had to do the right thing. I had to stick to your principles, man. Good game, coach. Jeez. Man, what's up, man? Let's get out of here. I gotta hang with my girl tonight. I gotta hang with her tonight. Gotta hang with this girl. What about his girl? Looks like you want the one with the mixed up priorities, huh? I think it's gonna take me a little longer than you might like. I just wanted you to know that I'm gonna try. Good, good, good. I know how much it meant to you. I ain't gonna lie. I wanted the Hall of Fame real bad. Aww. I wanted it too. There's always next year or year after that, as long as it takes for him to wise up. Wouldn't want it now anyway. But so red next. That's right. Good for you, girl. You're home! You're home! Bye, girl. Look at her in her little pajamas. Cute. Good job! Congratulations! Neighborhood hero. Everybody! Oh, this is so sweet. No! No! Is he alive? Is he alive? Everything was going so well. How's he doing? Not too good. Is he gonna die? How bad is it? He's paralyzed from the waist down. Oh no. Paralyzed. Only Ken's allowed in here. That's my brother. Brothers. I sure am sorry, man. I should have been there with you. Wow, well, that wouldn't have helped. When all this is over, and you're gonna move out the same neighborhood together. And get old. Oh, be best friends. It ain't gonna be all this black white between us. Left side. Strong side. Man, that sucks. Frick. Mm. Oh no, mama. Calls her mama. Maybe Yosu was right. Maybe I pushed him too hard. Carrie had an accident. Yeah, it wasn't playing. Sometimes life's just hard for no reason at all. Yeah, it's not his fault that the kid got hurt. Jeez. Hey, coach. Cheryl. Just for me. I want you to be my eyes out there, all right? It's so sad, this kid. Coach, I'm hurt. I ain't dead. No, you're not. <laughs> no, you're not. It's so sad you can't play. This is the granddaddy of state high school football championships, the Virginia Triple X. State championship game. Go Titans. Classic, what's the matter? Is he nervous? I'm eligible. <clears throat> I got a C plus average coach. So you go to college? I'm going to college. Oh, amazing. <laughs> Fantastic. He helped him. Entering the stadium now is Jean Bertier, and she's the mother of injured oh. All-American linebacker Gary Bertier. Oh, that's so nice. Here come the Titans, entering the stadium and wants to become their own unique style. Go Titans! I don't know if this is the kind of movie where they win or they lose, but they learn a lesson. Hi, I'm Emma Hoyt. Oh, oh well, I guess we never met, huh? She came to shake his hand. Well, now we've met. Yeah. It's nice to meet you. Yay! Fire! Wait, uh, that's not them. Bad guys. Okay, this is why I'm not good at watching sports. Remember who you're rooting for. Put some pressure on that QB. They got all day to throw, coach. You just worry about your offense. Oh, win it, win it! Yeah, these guys look good, though. The opposing team. Good opponents. Oh, touchdown. She was everywhere out there. It's like watching Monday Night Football or something. Good hustle, good hustle. That, that was a good hustle. Give him a little cushion. And when they throw that ball, you stick it. Ready? Come on, boys. Don't they have like a secret play or something that they've been working on all season that they could bust out at the last second? What do you think? You think we got to change? Of course. We got to give you some way to disguise that cover. Just start thinking about it. Let's go. Dad, go, boys. Fire it. Fumble. Is that a fumble? Fumble! DC Williams goes in at the half, trailing 7-0. All right, we're in a fight. And we need an inspiring speech. Win or lose. You're a team. We're gonna walk out of the stadium tonight with our heads held yeah. high. In all due respect, uh, you demanded more of us. You demanded perfection. He did, yes. He's correct. But we have won every single game we have played till now. So this team is perfect. Agreed. This is our time now. Second half is our time. Let's go, let's go. We're gonna play both ways. Rest of the game. 
I don't want a receiver to get across that line of scrimmage. Defense, defense. Things on three. One, two, three. I believe in them. Put the key to him. He's better. You want him to take your spot? Go give it to him. That's the right thing to do for the team. If you care about winning, that's what you got to do. Put him in. <laughs> okay, now we're going to win. Let's cook some butt. Got some great soundtrack happening in this movie. Her 70s. Come on, boys. So they trail Marshall 73, heading into the fourth. 73, though? <laughs> Just yelling at that rep. 99, you go. Wow, you're blind. Gun right. I did always kind of want to get fired up enough about a game to be like, Ref, are you blind? Oh man, he went all the way. Bubble. Nice. So now they have possession, right? Fake 23 blast with a backside George reverse. You got mm, that? Fake 23 blast with a backside George reverse. Oh, a backside George reverse. Let's do it. Cover deep. Come on, boys, we need a fancy play. They're going, they're going, two of them. Touchdown. Right? Well, that's it, boys. That's it. Yeah, fumbled. These boys earned it. Working together as a team. I know football, what you did with those boys. You were the right man for the job, coach. Whoa. Your Hall of Fame in my book. Both very classy. The Titans danced their way into history. 13 and 0. The wow. perfect season. Perfect season. <sighs> Gary Bertier won a gold medal for the shot put in the wheelchair games. Nice. Daddy coached him. Wow. Ten years later, Gary died, and that's what brought us back here today. But his spirit lives on. Hey, hey, hey. Goodbye. Oh, my captain really did bring them all together. Herman Boone coached the Titans football team for five more years. Helios well, assisted Herman Boone. He retired. They became good friends and continue their friendship to today. Well, that was great. Okay, guys, well, that was Remember the Titans. And that was so good. It really made me think about all the history with, you know, segregation and all that stuff and how freaking crazy that all is that that happened. This was a really good movie. I enjoyed it a lot. I thought all the all the kids, all the actors were really good. Denzel was really good. Good soundtrack. And a really, like, important story. It was based on a true story and I think it was a story that needed to be told, especially going and visiting it now at this time in the world and at this time this month. I'm, I'm glad I watched this one. This was an important story that I'm glad I know about. MVP, I will give it to Denzel. He was great. He was great in this. Very likable and very cool, like, commanding respect and, you know, running a tight ship, but being fair and, you know, inspiring his team and his town, really. Let me know if there are other Denzel movies I should check out. I do want to see some more Denzel. Definitely. Denzel as the coach will be the MVP. Loki MVP, I'm going to give to all the football team. They were not an easy bunch to get along at the beginning and you know i wasn't sure they were going to come together as a team i wasn't sure what kind of sports movie this was if it's going to have a happy ending or a sad ending so i am glad they came together i am glad they won the championship although that's not the important thing the important thing was that they learned to be a team and to be there for each other uh, despite their differences and i do think they inspired the whole town and maybe the whole country they were very cool and it was a really inspiring story so i will give the loki mvp to the titans and the worst award we're just gonna give to the fact that any of this had to happen at all uh it's just crazy you know where where we've been in the past is just nuts and let's just hope that we can go forward and grow into better people always so yeah that will be the worst overall this one was really good i'm very glad it won the football poll let me know if i should check out some other like sports movies i definitely would like to check out some sports movies hopefully they're not the kind where like me having intimate knowledge of the sport is necessary to understand and enjoy the story but definitely let me know what kind of sports movies you guys want to see and thank you guys so much for watching i really appreciate it i had a great time i hope you had a great time too i'll see you next time bye guys